Hello guys and welcome to Doza Digital, where we discuss everything crypto and also give you updates on opportunities in Web3. And in this particular video, on the 4th of July, Equal Protocol gave the criteria or should I say the steps that you need to follow in order for you to claim your tokens on the official claim date. And the deadline to do this particular tax that they've outlined is the 16th of July. That's just around um, the coming week. And so basically, what are the things that you are required to do? Number one is that you are going to connect your wallet on the turn minute in the Equal Protocol boot. And the recommended wallet that you are supposed to use is turn keeper, my turn wallet, turn up, or turn species. So whether you are farming the Zilli tax or whatever tax it is that you are doing, you need to ensure that your wallet is connected by 16th, all right? And that's not only that, because there are a lot of persons who abused the farming process. Some persons were able to accumulate points even without referring anybody. They accumulated points abysmally. And um, because of this, Equal Protocol is trying to ensure that there's a fair distribution of the Equal SP tokens among those who farmed Equal Points. And so what they have done is that they have partnered with Nomis Protocol, all right? Nomis Protocol is a reputation protocol that introduces an on-chain reputation system to turn, all right? What they do is that they assign users a score between 0 to 100 based on wallet activity. That means the wallet that you are going to be connecting to Nomis and also to your Equal Protocol should have at least two transactions, all right? So the essence of this is so that the system can detect both farms and also side views preventing abuse and rewarding genuine users. You know, when the token is in the hands of users who are not genuine, it's going to affect the overall value of the token, right? Especially when they have a large deposit of that particular token. And so what this particular protocol is trying to do is to ensure that they eliminate all those kinds of boats and cybers. So it's more like a KYC verification um, exercise, right? That means they are whitelisting your wallet just to ensure that your wallet has been active, okay? And so what you need to do in this is that you need to go to the Nomis protocol boat, uh, press the large button in the center area, connect your active wallet. Like I said, the wallet should have at least two transactions. Calculate your on-chain score. Make sure your wallet has turned for the transaction fee. Mint your score as an SBT NFT. Uh, the first 1 million people are going to get theirs for free and that's not about that so how do we do this all right so let's get straight into it the first thing i want to do is i want to go to my equal protocol boat and i'm going to launch it all right okay and i have an active wallet that is connected here so i'm going to disconnect this wallet because there's no transaction on this wallet of course you need to connect your wallet before the 14th of july to be whitelisted all right so i'm going to disconnect this wallet and i'm going to connect another wallet so i have imported a wallet that i have active transactions into this particular account so i'm going to connect this wallet all right so i'm going to enter in my um, uh, passcode and this wallet is, is done so it's going to take me back to the equal protocol boots and you can see the wallet is now what's connected that is the first step all right to ensuring that i am on track okay so the next thing i'm going to do now is i'm going to go straight to the nomis app all right and i'm going to click on start okay so i'll click on start on this nomis app all right now the beautiful thing about this nomis app is that you can also collect points i think that the nomis um protocol they are going to be having their own native token and so now what it means is that each time you collect um points every eight hours all right that point is going to be converted to their native token so okay the next thing i'm going to do now is that i'm going to click on this orange area or i can just use to connect wallets all right so i'll click on this part and you can see so get your turn reputation score all right on chain bring your transaction history on turn on chain by minting your nft score AI Nomis utilizes advanced AI tech to assign your wallet address a reputation score from 0 to 100. So I'm going to click on start. All right. So I'm going to click on connect wallet. Okay. So I'm going to select my tongue keeper. All right. I'm going to connect this particular wallet. It is the same wallet that I've connected to my Echo protocol boat. Take note. All right. So I'm going to click on connect wallet. Then again, I'm going to enter, enter my passcode. And you can see it, says it is done. All right. So it's going to take me back to the Nomis app. The wallet is connected. You can see. The wallet is already what's connected here as you can see it all right so the next thing i'm going to do is that i'm going to click on calculate stone score all right this might take a while so just wait for it okay 
Okay, so my turn score has been calculated for this wallet. So in this particular wallet, I've been rated 17. That means the transactions that I've done on this particular wallet has earned me 17 score, which is not really bad, right? So you can see this is my wallet. It's a native balance 0.16 ton, um, in value 1.1 USD of the ton. Then um, old token balance, I have the particular token insect 2.5 USD. The wallet age is two months. So the transactions that I've done just 26, the average transaction time is 83.3 and all of those other words, other stuff, okay? So remember, for you to be able to mint your score, you need to have at least 0.1 ton. You can see it here. So if you don't have 0.1 ton, it will be very um, difficult for you to mint your score. So if you want to buy ton, you can go to any of the centralized exchanges and buy ton, or you can through your ton keeper. That is, if you have USDT in your wallet, you can also be able to buy ton. Or if you cannot do any of those yourself, you can actually reach out to me, and I'm going to provide some support to you. So you're going to click on mint score for free. I'm going to wait for it to um, process. So it has come to this wallet. All right. I'm just going to wait for it to um, show me this. So what I'm going to do is that you can see this is 0 0.112 ton. That's what it's going to take. Then uh, plus the gas fee that will be that will, that will be charged. So I'm going to approve this. All right. Then we're going to wait. I'm going to enter my passcode, and it can see it's going to it's going to click on done. Then it says confirm the transaction in ton keeper. It will only take a moment. All right. So your transaction is what is pending. Okay. So I'm just going to wait for this and see. What happens thereafter okay so it says transaction is being processed so um just going to wait for this to completely process all right um, but before then there are some tasks that you can actually do you can see this part here there's a tax button you can click on those tags there and just do all of these tasks that are here all right you can see i've actually done this particular tax okay which is um for me to um means my turn score so i'm just going to claim this but it says meet the condition and try again so i'm just going to leave this and come back to it again then you can see participate to not miss quest so i'm going to start this all right so i'm going to come back here i'll wait for it to approve um there are a lot of um there are a lot of tasks that you can actually do to earn some no miss points all right um very important so i'm going to come back here and see Okay, this is still this is still getting um, loaded, so I'm just going to refresh it again and see if they have finally updated my um, my mint is now active. Okay, so my mint is now active. You can see it says update your score for free. Okay, that means I can consistently decide to update this. So how do I know if my NFT is now in my account? So I'm going to go straight back to my Tone Keeper wallet. All right, I'm going to come to my Tone Keeper. You can actually see this part here where they have collectibles, all right? So I'm just going to click on that collectibles. As you can see, my Nomi's um, score is already what's minted. So that means I am now qualified for the Equa Protocol. Um, I'm now qualified to claim my Equa Protocol XP on the day of what on the day of um, claiming all right so guys that's how you do the nomis app verification if you encounter any challenge or any issue you can drop a question remember this is time sensitive you need to get this done before or, or on the 16th of um july all right so that'll be all for now guys i'll see you again in my next video